Hey guys, I'm Ethio for Phone Radar and this is the Easy Phone. Now this isn't a smartphone but a smart feature phone. Now you may doubt why would be doing a unboxing of this uh, simple phone and the primary reason is that this is specifically for the senior citizens and for people who have trouble in using a smartphone. So this phone has a price of 3375 rupees and if you talk about the features here you can see that it comes with uh, a 2.2 inches display again the brand mentioned it as a large 2.2 inch display which is a joke but again this is again a phone not for the general users. It comes with a large keypad, large fonts, talking keyboard, magnifier. Uh, option to whitelist or blacklist some numbers, advanced SOS feature, phone contacts in actual photos which means that you get photo contacts, a cradle charger and disk kit back, a torch with side key and a customizable menu. So this is what all you get on this phone and when you talk about the advanced SOS feature it means that you can set up to 5 emergency contacts and then you can contact these in case of an emergency. Now this is from a brand called as uh, Senior World and this is called as uh, Easy Phone and the one which we have here with us is the black color variant. So let's open up the package and uh, check out what all comes within the same. So here within the package you have this 700mAh of battery. You have this user manual to understand how you could be using this phone. The charging cradle where you just have to place the phone on the top of this and that is something very smart rather than asking the person to actually insert a USB type C or a USB cable at least and this would be actually better because you just plug this to the power and that gets connected on the back while the phone would just be placed here and it would also act as a display. Now here is the actual product that's the senior world uh, easy phone now it would have been uh, almost a decade after which i'm actually holding a feature phone in my hand and it would be pretty hard for me to actually understand uh, the options because it comes with the t9 keyboard and a lot of stuff which we used to see uh, almost a decade back before the smartphones had actually taken over the industry but that said let's check it out let's push this battery here and you can also make, make a note on the sim card slot which is below the battery so let's push that back and uh, check out the phone itself now when you talk about the physical uh, overview of this phone it has these large uh, buttons which are very easy to actually uh, press and on the right you have the option to switch on and off or lock the phone while on the back you have the SOS button with the camera. I guess this is a 2 megapixel camera on this phone but you can check out the link in the description to know more about the same. While on the bottom you have the charging cradle support or you can also directly charge it with the USB cable which you get within the package. And there is also a small torch and to enable that you have this option of uh, uh, enabling or disabling the torch which is the control is actually mentioned here. So that's what you have. On the top there is nothing else and uh, this is the complete smartphone or you can say the smart feature phone. Here is how you can just place it on the top and it will start charging. So I will be doing that separately later on but let's start up this phone and uh, check out what all comes within this uh, phone uh, in terms of the features. And we are here, you can see that we have the menu button here where you have the phone book, messages, call history, alarm, camera. Let me first check out the camera and here we are on the camera area let's quickly capture a photo and here we go not bad i would say it's again not a touch screen uh, but you get the option of sending this via bluetooth so these are uh, the options under camera let's go back here you also have this fm radio option of magnifier so let's say you would like to read something you can clearly see the screen has actually magnified let's try to read something from this uh, manual and uh, show you the demo so let's say if i would like to read this legal information using this phone here is how it looks almost 2x of magnification that's pretty good enough let's go back and you also have this audio player organizer and settings this some option called as Zoo, but let's go to the settings and here you have the SOS settings, phone settings, calls, profile, speed dial, height function, security and restore. So here under SOS you can actually set up the numbers where you can add the numbers which you would be dialing in case of an emergency. You Here you need to save your personal number which you feel uh, should be contacted in case of emergency. And here let's say you can enable this and uh, 
the next time you press SOS it would actually after the countdown so that's how the SOS part work I'll have to look into the other options to check out the other SOS uh, settings so that's what you get under SOS you also have this phone settings and here you can change the wallpaper LCD backlight and other stuff so this is what you get you also have the option of uh, photo contacts again have been having a habit of uh, tapping on the screen because thinking this has an uh, smartphone but that's it save and uh, options I can edit it and here I can actually set up my photo I hope it turned out to be okay and it, this is the photo we just captured with this phone and that would be set up here and done so this is the photo contact uh, which is set here so let's say if I if someone has to search for me that can be done and here is the photo contact if someone wants to call me they can just go here since the number has not been set but that's how it works so these are few of the functions which we get on this phone a very interesting phone and very lightweight and it comes with a very interesting uh, cradle option where the person can just place it here so this is priced at around 3300 or something as such and uh, that's the user manual so which comes within the package i was specifically interested in testing this out to actually understand how these phones work and are they really useful but i would say yes it's a pretty uh, smart feature phone wherein uh, it offers some decent options but i hope the brand came up with some better torch than this very dim one and also offer a little bit larger screen but that's it this is what you get and this is the easy phone from senior world don't forget to hit the thumbs up button and let me know in the comment section if you have any queries this is amit signing off and i hope to see you guys in the next video thank you